Hey, how's it going? Today I'm going to be talking about the website and what that is. Most of the people probably know, but just in case, a website is a collection of web pages and digital content that are accessible via World Wide Web. Websites are typically hosted on the web servers and are made available to users throughout web browsers, such as uh, many providers, as <laughs> different businesses, I won't, won't go and be naming those. If you are offering products and services, I would highly recommend having a website. So websites have the different structures. Some of those websites would be something that's called landing pages. Some of those uh, websites will have a function and that function can be sell products and services and uh, customers can actually make a payment. I uh, would be focusing on the websites and uh, the structure of the websites where customers can make a payment. I would highly recommend for everyone to do and have a website. Web pages. Websites consist of individual web pages, each of which contains text, images, multimedia elements and hyper hyperlinks. These pages are designed to be viewed in a web browser. Some of those are not necessarily limited to, but can be open on apps, uh, as well as a web browser, as well as some of a website providers offer a function where your website can be offered as an app to on a different platforms to download. Uh, so there are different options available. When it comes to a website structure, I would highly recommend to to structure your website where you will have product placement and product placement needs to be a sort of uh, elevator pitch uh, uh, system from a top down where you're promoting and uh, or showing your products and services that you are looking to sell or offer to potential customers. Uh, after you build a website or before you build a website, I would highly recommend before, but it's up to you how serious you are about doing uh, this project of building a website. If, it, uh, if you're doing it for the first time and, uh, and you're not that serious, perhaps uh, the buying domain name might be a waste of money and time. Perhaps build a website first and later attach any domain name that you would like to your website. It's up to you how you like to do it. Content. Websites can contain a wide range of content including information pages, articles, blogs, posts, production, uh, pro product listings, images, videos, interactive forms and more. There is a reason uh, why most of the websites will have certain content on there. Uh, there is different strategies and ways to think about how you want to place and uh, keep people on the website as well as how you want to show your product services. There's a lot of different structures, but before we can look at the different structures, we need to first, we need to have a website. <laughs> purpose, website can serve various purposes such as providing information, promoting products or services, facilitating e-commerce transactions, offering education source, uh, resources, or enabling social networking. Design and layout. Design and layout of the website are important for user experience. A well-designed website is visually appealing, easy to navigate, and optimized for different devices. Uh, the font designs and the image quality. So there's so many things to think of. Functionality. Websites may include uh, interactive features and functionality such as content forms search bars, online shopping carts, and user re re registration, and content management system, CMC, for easy content updates. Once you have a website, uh, you can find website hosting. Uh, there is a diff there are different topic. I have spent a lot of time looking for it, and I managed to find everything for free of charge, so I don't need to pay for anything, and everything's in one place. Uh, other than that, there's a different uh, places or things that you might need to add and build Frankenstein sort of thing. Where you need to find that one, you need to find that, that because when you have a website, there's different components that you need to know of when, when building a website. Uh, it, it, it can be a complicated process, but uh, yeah. <laughs> 
once you start doing it, it will get easier, I guess. Development technologies websites are built using various web development technologies, including HTML, Hyper uh, Markup Language, CSS, Cascading Style Sheets, JavaScript, and Service. Some of those uh, websites uh, that you are visiting, some, uh, some of those are dynamic and some of those static. Uh, most of the websites are online are dynamic. Uh, static websites, but there are uh, not that many of those. Uh, security features. Website security is essential for protecting against cyber threats, data breaches, and uh, unauthorized access. This includes using secure protocols, HTTPS, regularly updated and strong authorization measures. In other words, that uh, small padlock symbol is something that's called SSL certificate. Uh, you can have uh, outsourced that. If your website don't have this feature, you can outsource with different service providers who offer the service for free. So there are options available. Or you can have hosting services that you offer that services together for free. So different ways how you can go about it. You can either outsource these kind of services or you can have everything already built in, but you know, what I'm saying, you don't need to pay for any of that. <laughs> most, of, most of the people offering that for free, but if you want, you can pay. CEO, or the word search engines optimization. Uh, CEO practices are used to optimize websites for each engine like Google. This involves all search engines, different, uh, not necessarily limited just to that service provider. This involves uh, techniques to improve website visibility and urge search engines since uh, uh, it's constantly moving so the overall uh, you want to be in a front page but uh, how to achieve that unless you do and uh, currently up to date to current trends you might find it it's uh, challenging to do that in the beginning but uh, definitely how to optimize everything should be on your mind just so it would be in front of uh, all the search engines and uh, a lot of people would uh, uh, direct uh, would be directed to your website. Maintenance websites require ongoing maintenance to ensure they remain functional, secure, and up to date. This includes updating content, monitoring performance, and applying security patches. Not necessary, depending on perhaps size of the website and the size of the company and how much capital you have to allocate. If you're running a small business, uh, medium, uh, small to medium sized business, not necessarily that's the optimal way to think about it. But uh, there are a lot of free options to do that that you can do yourself. And uh, once you get used to it, it's not that difficult to do once a year. I would recommend doing it at least once a year. Analytics website owners often use analytic tools to track user behavior, gather data, website traffic, and make informed decisions for improvements. Mobile responsiveness with the increased use of, of mobile devices is crucial for a website to be more mobile friendly and responsive, ensuring seamless experience for users, smartphones, or tablets. I would highly recommend for uh, everyone who is currently in the process, perhaps uh, doing a, a whatever you might be in current stage, if you perhaps working with somebody else now, perhaps you might want to do some research before starting your own business, or if you already have your business or you uh, had your own business running a couple of businesses, as well as you perhaps looking to invest in different businesses and doing market research. There's a little bit for everyone within the market from very general general information as well as perhaps if you looking to understand trends and where the world is moving and shifting within the next five, 10 years. I have shared a lot, a lot of information in this book. I highly recommend for everyone to purchase this particular book, this name of the book. Game strategy. You can go to the link in the description and purchase this book on top retailers. Thank you. Websites are a functional part of modern internet ecosystem. Service as means for individuals, business, organizations, and institutions to share information communicate with audience, conduct transactions, and engage with 
online world uh, the creation and maintenance of website involves a combination of web design development content creation and digital marketing efforts i would highly recommend to do everything yourself uh, i uh, uh, if you need some guidance, if you need some perhaps information, I can direct you. Uh, not not necessarily. I would <laughs> I'd rather explain how to do it than do everything for people. Hopefully, then we have better people around us who have done everything <laughs> themselves, and they don't need to seek for help. Uh, that's one of the reasons why I'm offering this educational material. But once you have the ball rolling and you need some assistance, perhaps then we can work together. Other than that, thank, thanks for watching and see you next one.